so hello guys and welcome back again to my youtube channel it's me your girl kelly girl welcome to kelly review and gist so in today's video i have an important message for summer girl. um i have um this to tell summer girl, like she needs to hear this okay summer girl need to hear this um but before i go into what i have for her and the lesson she should she should learn now okay she should act fast now she should do this now or you know face the same consequences because um me personally i'm not one of the people that will see what is not good or what will affect somebody or harm somebody and decided to keep quiet i can't do that i will always speak out it is left for the person to take correction now in life we don't know it all okay Sometimes we'll be turning into um, towards direction we feel like is safe, is good. Why on the wrong run we'll find out that we we are not going the better way. There is no um, light at the end of the tunnel. Okay. Um, now before I go into the video, the message I have for her or this. Um, something that i know that will serve as a kind of warning not even a warning but you know something she should use to see herself and correct herself so it's a kind of warning um before i go into that let me work on the newbies that will be seeing this video if you're new um subscriber you are highly welcome in fact if you are new to my channel hello welcome remember to subscribe please be my um, subscriber be part of this family and after you subscribe remember to turn on your notification bell that will be notified anytime i drop any new video if you're a returning subscriber my people my people thank you guys for your support for your love i don't take them for granted i pray that the good lord will bless and enlarge your scopes more money into your pocket in jesus name amen so guys grab your popcorn and your champagne let's dive into today's video properly so guys um welcome back okay now like i said this is um an important message to summer now it's not only for summer it's for all of us we can learn one or two things from this video it doesn't mean that we know it all we don't know all okay we are human our human are bound with mistakes so um it's not a matter of making mistakes it's a matter of you know trying to correct your mistakes and knowing where you you fall knowing where you you know you are doing wrong and try to correct it that's the most important thing in life or what i think that is important thing in life but as for mistake is inevitable provided that human existence is assured uh, mistake is inevitable it's only god that cannot do mistake mistake is inevitable okay yes the way they used to say death is inevitable is the same way that mistake is inevitable nobody is perfect in life so let's not even judge or try to you know pretend to be sent i am not one of them i've made one or two mistakes and i'm not going to tell that that mistake is where it's going to stop i might still make more okay that's life for you but ability for you to you know detect your mistake ability for you to go back and draw the line and correct your mistake is what makes you a good person now going back to summer like i said it's not it's not only for summer it's for all of us that are human being if you're a living human being you are breathing you are alive this is for all of us yes including me that is here okay so now let me go back to summer you guys know who summer is on this youtube space you know what she does if you don't know her i don't know whether you are watching youtube at all okay she's a nigerian youtuber living in i am um, irish abby um she does her content around everything we go to go she puts mouth in everything that is happening be it politics be it um um be it uh, pastors and the religious stuff be it celebrity talk be it anything like be it youtubers okay like that someone could did not see what to talk is like is what prevents her from talking do you get so i just want to put it out here she talks as in in fact at this point i don't know her niche her niche is talking that's what i know her <laughs> it's like me self i'm even trying to adapt that niche self 
okay? Uh, because I love her. I love the way she talks. I love her, her boldness, her plainness. The way she, you know, portrays matters and you understand it easily. Now, what am I saying? It is concerning the issue of um, pastors, okay? Especially um, Pastor Suleiman or Apostle Suleiman. Now, before most of you start um, dropping comments on the under the com down down the comment section, please understand me very well. But you can still drop your comment. You start now to drop your comment. It is welcome. Anything you want to say, say it. But hear me out, okay? Now, um, what am I saying about her? So, Marco, the way she talked about pastors, especially pastor or apostle Suleiman. Now, I'm not um, a fan of Suleiman. I am not one of um, his members. I have not even, no, in fact, I have not gone to his church. I'm not even planning to go. But let's tell ourselves the truth, okay? I'm not here to say that she shouldn't talk about pastors. I'm not here to tell her not to talk about pastors or to condemn her. No, this is a free world. We have um, freedom of speech, okay? But as a Christian, she said that she's a Christian, right? As a Christian, the way you, you know, convey message about pastors, the way you talk about them, really, you know, portray a lot about you, really says a lot about you, okay? There are some things she has said about pastors that, you know, um, I accept, I can see reasons with that, but there are a lot she says about pastors that um, sometimes I'll be like, this, this woman, you know they fear? You know they fear God? You know they fear for your life? Like, okay, okay, mm-hmm. Now, let's not forget that these pastors are God's instruments. There are some things they will do. You don't know whether they have make up with their makers, they have gone back to, you know, draw the line and pray. That is why I say that mistake is inevitable, be you a pastor or anybody. You must make mistake. But your ability to go back and, you know, ask for forgiveness, maybe these pastors she's talking about them, they have make up with their makers, they are not in good terms with God, you know? And she, the way she carried the matter. Now, you can talk about a pastor, but the way she conclude about them, okay? Now, let me use this pastor, Suleiman, as example. Suleiman and the um, Ote, Otibo, Abi, Stephanie Otebo, Abi. Now, there is one video someone could do about Stephanie Otebo and Suleiman. According to her, she said she believes Stephanie. She believe her. Everything she says, she believe her. There's another video she made about this woman, um, that surface. According to her, she believed her. Like, it seems as if she is jumping into conclusion. Now, why did I say that this have as a warning to her? You know, there's this lady called uh, Maureen, uh, Ma Maureen, you guys know her, her channel was taken down, two channels. She has built a niche for herself, like, built a good audience for herself and two of them were taken down. Like I was watching Maureen at a point, I was like, do you have personal beef with this man? You can condemn what somebody did, but like the way she was going about it, even went ahead to write a, a book about a particular pastor, about Suleiman. Like, it seems like she has personal stuff with that man. Do you get, you, you can analyze a, a um, pastor when people are talking or, you know, let's say for the, for instance, Stephanie Otobo's message or Wahala or beef with Suleiman, you can talk about it, but you be neutral, you know. Don't try to cite either pastor or the girl because take it or leave it, devil can use anybody to fight a pastor. Nobody knows the truth. Stephanie cannot even provide a video of what happened. Like, you can tell me that. How, how will you even explain that I will be with a pastor? I will not make a video. Even if it's a secret video, all she kept on, she kept on providing was um, photos upon photos. We all know that we can Photoshop, even video shop these days. But let's see video of what you claim that happened. You, and if like a, an international babe like you, like you know what you are into, she knows what she's doing, that she can use video to blackmail somebody and collect money, like do a lot of things with evidence. And you are telling me she don't have a video. 
let's like personally i'm not saying that i support Suleiman because his own self the way his name is flying i don't know whether he's only the pastor we have like himself he should be careful of how he deal with people or how his nature leads him to deal with people or leading to temptation but the truth is that we don't know whether he did it or not you are reporting something you were not there when it happened, you are reporting something that's your face on social media. Report it the way the person say it and move on. This is me for you. Okay. It is not left for the person to know whether it's true or not. But you concluding whether um concluding that you are sure of it, that you believe it, you did this, really shows that maybe you are, you know. Um, colliding with that person to attack that pastor so to avoid her own channel being taken down that's what i'm saying all these things so leave your opinion down in the comment section remember to like share and do all that good stuff and i'll see you in my next video